what is up guys welcome to another tutorial in this tutorial we are going to learn about how to make our software friendly for other users as well by friendly for other users I mean transactions should be done daily without having to close the software so we need to empty the list once the bill has been generated and we have to also delete the labels these labels actually that are generated from the loop these labels so we have to delete these as well so first what we will do is we'll create uh, I haven't found any easier way to delete those I always end up having some errors but I think this is kind of like a backup plan or something we'll say list for labels and we will say labels list equals to empty list so what we are going to do is let's just copy this for once and the loop that is generating the yes this loop it's generating these labels we will you know append these uh we'll append these uh sorry then this label object label object in this labels list so we can delete that all after the bill has been generated self dot name so let's copy this all and we can just use it in the same label because it is going to delete everything from that I mean same list so temp name temp qt and there's a temp price okay so now that it is generated we need to delete is this the print bill no it's add to cart to generate bill yes so we will decrease the stock and do everything and all now after that we will say for a in range sorry we'll say for a in labels underscore list a dot destroy let's try this our other everything seems to be working except for this one let's try okay we'll say one we'll buy one of these we'll say two we'll buy two of these it's 50 rupees they gave me 100 so I need to return 50 I'll generate bill and yes it's deleted as you can see so the next customer is ready one at to car okay it is not because the list is not deleted only this labels are deleted and total is not deleted as well so we will do that and the list as well so for a in list we will say we don't need to do it in the loop we'll say empty or, uh, it's not empty I guess it's delete the list name what are the list name? I think it's the products list product price product comment mm, delete products list and we need to set the index to this colon so it will delete everything from that list similarly we need to delete from the products uh, ID each and everything like creating and deleting a session product uh, name I mean no 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 product uh, product quantity and product price I think that's just it mm, four of those lists mm, yes for those lists it's good and now also the total we need to total L we need to configure the total L to an empty text so we'll say self dot total dot configure text is equals to empty done everything and let's check it we'll say one search I'll buy ten of these to search I'll buy two of these and I'm ready to generate bill I get 500 return is 180 generate bill okay everything is deleted configure is out and we'll buy a new thing again we'll buy 10 of these 
And yes, it seems to be working. It's starting for the new user, KitKat 10300. Number two will buy one of these at the 310. It's working great. So for the next customer, I think we should again finalize it by like please forgetting this label and setting this to zero. Okay, let's try that. Where is this uh, change amount? Self dot c amount dot please forget change function will create that okay mm, self dot c amount dot let's see configure text equals to this and uh, where is the input for the change e change e c a change e underscore e so we need to delete change e so we'll do self dot change e dot delete zero end okay let's check it again one two uh, let's buy three three one uh, it's 1000 okay 340 journal bill okay everything is good it has been placed forgotten I mean deleted or I mean the text has been configured it is gone and enter products one two five hundred it's working great so that's working great after that we can further modify by focusing into this uh, Sorry, where is it? Enter IDE. We can focus it into Enter IDE to get greater efficiency. Self dot self dot Enter IDE dot focus after everything has been done. So this was the uh, one of the uh, last phases of the main application. What we need to do is all, all that's left to do is generate the actual bill like printing physically from a printer we need to work on the bill template we need to fill in the bill template with the dynamic data that users are buying and uh, we also need to convert this whole application into .exe so that nobody can touch the source code and they can work seamlessly in the store and there are a few more modifications like keyboard bindings as well which we will talk in another video and thanks for watching stay tuned for my next video